Well, back in, welcome, uh, welcome back to Diggin' Georgia. I got a little update um, on my pepper plants in the garden over here. I got it getting stuff situated. I've been doing a lot better now. And uh, stuff's getting back to normal around here, hopefully. But um, I'll go ahead and start with my Carolina Reaper. This thing hasn't even uh, started producing yet. It has doing, been doing some, some bulbs little flowers but they fell off but uh got some new ones coming along so hopefully they'll pick up since i put it out here in the sun i had it in the shade of my, my mimosa tree over there along with my ghost pepper plant and uh ghost pepper doing good he's, he's about to get some more some more um units in here got more buds on there look how big it is huge i hear some red devil looking I got three on there right now so they're ready I had a whole uh, about I gave I think four or five away to a friend and I cooked up three of them with some garlic some oil I had some advice to make some paste and I put in some rice that was some hot rice that was pretty good too um got me a little what do you call sycamore tree going on here my Ky not cayenne uh, serranos that took out the ground they they trying to come back they've they been making more babies than they've been making leaves so i just go ahead and let it do what it's doing i've been watering it every day it's been okay weather i mean today it was like the heat index of 105 but i watered the pepper plants down they've been doing pretty good what, the, what is that Man, he got tore up. Oh well, I got some habaneros. I got to pick again. Tucked in there. Now I guess we we'll go ahead and check over here at the garden. Here's what I did. I clean, I've been cleaning it out and getting it back situated here. Uh, I went ahead and had my bell peppers over there. They was taking a a hit. Oh, let me get this. It was taking a hit, so I decided to go ahead and just transplant them down here. I got the compost, put compost manure, uh, mushroom compost um, inside the hole. So I put it down, put a good layer of uh, grass, leaves, and uh, they've been doing pretty good through the heat. I watered them down today, and they're doing real good. Surprisingly, I transplanted them in, in the heat, and they took well. I mean, it was a last-ditch effort to get them going again. So, I had to do what I had to do. And the Cuban nails over here, I trimmed him up. Um, that's what it looked like. But they get bigger than that. But I don't think these these are going to get bigger right now. But uh, I still use them. <laughs> Having arrows over here, I put mushroom compost down there on top. And they seem to be doing loving that. Uh, peppers are getting back to looking better they were looking kind of white looking i took them off threw them on the ground and uh maybe we can get them back to going again look at that one he's just poking on up there jalapenos i got some more red ones coming along and i want to use the bacon on these things bacon and cheese and all that stuff so i'm waiting for them to get a little plumper and uh we can eat them later on but they're budding again they're starting to flower on all over the place and they, they get a good go, growth spurt be, due to because I'm, uh, I took the sunflowers out. That sunflower, he just broke. Something, something broke the sunflower up there. Hanging. These habaneros still doing good. Pretty good. Basil. Getting more seeds coming. Smells so good. If you look down there, I got a eggplant. A couple of them down there. They're ready to be seeded, but the ones at the top are are um they ready to be taken off. Some of them, some of them got heat stress. But uh, you can see the black beauties over there looking things. Yeah, 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 it's getting there. A little bit longer. See all these bugs right here? They all came from the sunflowers. 
Since there ain't no sunflowers, they um uh, they crawling all over the place. There's a big one there. Come here. Show them the big one back here. Huh? There's a big one right there. Where? It's a big one. Down over there? Yeah. This one? <laughs> no, not that one. This one. Talking about. It's kind of big one. Yeah, there's a bugs one. on it. Ah, it's gonna get you. Here you go. Over here, I still got the cucumbers growing. They, I don't think they gonna make it, but they could. That's the ones that just popped up by itself. They gonna do what they gonna do. It's gonna be the junk area, and I'm just gonna smooth it on down and probably make it back to grass. I got some plans later on. Um, I tell you that uh, I got some plans later on to probably do up like a above ground brick kind of layout, so I can just plant inside the. Uh, plant inside them and just have walkways with grass between them and stuff like that. That's why I plan. I seen a community community garden with that. That was a good idea. So I might go ahead along with that. But everything's coming along well. I'm back and back to order. Feeling good. Wife's feeling good. So in due time, I'll be hopefully I'll be planting something. I got my banana peppers growing in there. They might have a. They might have a. Uh, I don't know. They. They might not, might have to keep them inside, so I don't know, depending on how they grow. But uh, that's an update for this week. Have a good Friday, and wear that mask out there.